Yes. What are you doing, Craig? I'm reading a book. A book? Yes, it's like a very long Twitter. Um... <laughs> It's a book written... You see, I thought this thing was that when we have people on the show who have movies, we have a clip of their movie. You go, and now take a look at a little bit of the movie. And you look at the movie and you go, ooh, that looks great. I'll have to go and enjoy that. Well, I thought, well, it's not fair on the authors when they turn up because they don't get... You can't go have a look at this clip of the book. And then I thought, well, I'll just read a clip from the book. <laughs> so let me, uh, let me read a clip from... Uh, not easy getting a clip you can read on CBS from a Jackie Collins book. <laughs> All uh, right. Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Chapter 24. Mary Ellen stayed the night. Dawn had not planned on her spending the night in his bed, but how could he throw her out right after they'd made love? <laughs> he'd never been adept at getting rid of women after he'd slept with them. <laughs> As soon as they were off the premises, it was easy. Don't take their calls, don't answer their emails, and never reply to their texts. But once they were snugly settled in his bed, it was a different situation. <laughs> Please welcome the author of Married Lovers, the wonder that is Jackie Collins, everybody. Jackie Collins. I was just reading your book to the ladies and gentlemen. I know, but did you know there's what? a character in this book, ladies, called Don Verona, who's a very sexy talk show host. Remind you of anyone? <laughs> so it's based on Conan O'Brien, is it? No, aren't you beating him out in the ratings? Didn't I read no, that? Yeah, well, he's on an hour before me, but yeah, yes. actually, I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, okay. I, yeah, yeah. I, Uh, I, I beat American Idol, and wow. uh, yeah, I, this is now the most watched show since the moon landing. I can't believe that. I watch it every night, of course. Uh, yeah, do yes. you really? I TiVo it. Do you, I TiVo you, it. you have the TiVo, yeah. and then what, you watch it in the I morning? I have noticed something about this show, though, Craig, and I, I wanted to say this to you. What? You speak a lot about your... Um, Business? Sure. Yeah, a lot. Have you noticed that audience? Wait, wait, yeah. wait, wait, wait. Before you start soliciting the audience, wait a minute, you're Jackie Collins. Don't you give me lectures on business. You've got business what? all through this. Book. I know, but, but you have names for it. And you want to know the best one that you've got? What? Sly and the Family Stones. Oh, yeah, well. Yeah. That's, that's cool. That's really cool. That was a very good one. Yeah, well, yeah. you know, it's uh, you got to do what you do. You yeah, know. you know. <laughs> Uh, uh, there really is a character based on me in this book. There is, you well, know, because before you were married, of course. Right. I would watch you on the show, and I would see all these beautiful actresses come on. Yeah, I And you would that. be very flirty, as opposed to farty. Flirty. Right, here we go. <laughs> Although maybe you were farty, too. I don't I know. can do both at the same time. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm European. They teach us that. <laughs> and I thought, wow, that's interesting, you know. That's an interesting character. Right. Because he's a guy that kind of like, you know, loves the ladies. Oh, yeah. And it's sort of like a dating pool, isn't it? I mean, you know, all these young actresses come Oh, on no, and... it's not really like that. It I might know. look like that, but it's not like that. I know what you went out with. Yeah. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh, well, you went why out with don't her you once. Just... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm hey. not going to name any names. All right. No. No. <laughs> and, then, and then you told her that your, um, somebody was sick in Scotland and you had to leave. <laughs> There might I well have been somebody <laughs> sick in Scotland. I, I don't know. I people often get sick in somebody. Scotland. The weather there's terrible. Yeah. That was a very good excuse. Yeah, thanks I thought very that was much. Good. Yes, on the yeah. next plane he was. I think I know what you're yeah. talking about as well. All right. Oh. So, uh, <laughs> now, um, yes. Yes. so are you going on a big tour with the book? Are you I going went around? on the big tour with it, with the hardcover of the book. This is the paperback that just came out. And I went to 26 countries in a rock and roll bus. In a bus? The south. Well, it was like a, a rock star bus. Wow. It was fantastic. I'd have my name all over it, and I would stop off at Target, and everybody would go, oh, wow, this is incredible. And I went to, like, New Orleans. Did you drive and... it yourself? Oh, yes, yeah, sure. I was driving the bus. That's quite a sexy bus driver. That'd be good. 
I had a sexy bus driver. Did you really? Yes, there was a fantastic bedroom on the plane. Not on the plane. On the I stopped and went on a plane occasionally. But I go 500 miles. Did you have a bus. plane with a bedroom on it as well? Yeah. Everywhere you go, there's a bedroom. You're Jackie of Collins. <laughs> The world is your bedroom. Uh, exactly. Yeah. I have to do research. Right. It's very important to do no, research no, constantly. Right. So and this week I finished my new book too. Oh, you did? Yeah. And I'm when did you start it? I started uh, last week. <laughs> 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 I've been writing it for nine months. It's oh, right. Like okay. That's about right. It's called yeah. Poor Little Bitch Girl. <laughs> Oh, you'll yeah. never guess who it's about. Um, you'll read it and you'll have fun. I, I can no, you won't read it because I will. you read kind of more serious things. No, I, I've, read, I've read, I haven't read this one, but I've read Hollywood Husbands and I've read oh, Hollywood good. Wives. Oh, and I've, yeah, well, now I've, you will read this now you know about Don Verona and his yeah, Don Verona appetite. is based on me? Is it, yes. Do you talk about his business in here? Of like, course. do you imagine my business? Yeah, so you imagined then, you imagined <laughs> my intimate moments well, you then. you talk about it all the time. Well, yeah, it's a joke when I do it. I didn't sit down and imagine it in a book. Now you tell me. Well, yeah, you I mean... You should have told me before. I, You're I, all over this book. Listen... Intimate moments and, you know, with Cameron Paradise. That's my heroine. Cameron Paradise? Yes, Cameron Paradise. That's an awesome <laughs> name. <laughs> I know. I, that's the name I but, used to dance under, actually. <laughs> that. Here's the downer. Well, she falls in love with your best friend, with Don's best friend. I don't have a best Who's married. Friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Married to a Hollywood princess. And so Don desires this woman, but she, but doesn't she want wants his best friend. Uh, that's a dilemma. Yeah, that's based on my and life. And, you I know, it's, <laughs> it's always a dilemma if you're stuck in a marriage and you're looking out there and seeing your soulmate. Has no, that ever happened I've, to you? No, it's never happened to me, actually. No, I'm uh, one dame at a time type of thing. Yes, you know, and this um, is the third wife? Yeah. But, but, <laughs> but well, hey, to be fair, in a row. Oh, he's going to get In a row. <laughs> I mean, it's not like I was like, you know, you know, still getting rid of one and getting on to another one. You get right, that one, right? That's uh, that next. done. Enforced yes. period of yes. solitude. I go to my fortress of solitude at the North Pole. I think for a while. Then I come back out and try again, and it fails. Then I go back to my fortress of solitude. Then I come back out, and then, you know. Oh, I think it's great. I, I was watching you the other night when you said that you and your wife like to sit in a coffee shop and criticize people. Yes, yes, we do, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what we do, we sit quietly and just yes. judge other people harshly. I do the same thing. It's fun, isn't I it? Know. I know. Yeah. I, I take my kids to Disneyland. Right. And I'll sit in Disneyland and I'll watch people and I'll write, you know, little descriptions. Because, you, you know, fact is almost so strange. Yeah, it's much true. Stranger Absolutely than true, yeah. Yes. If I got that out, yeah. No, no, you don't. Yeah, 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 no, you don't. <laughs> but it is because you, you look at the headlines and see what goes on and nobody would believe it. I know. I know. It's crazy. The, the whole Michael Jackson thing that's going on oh, now. Oh, man, Farrah that's crazy. That's a really, I, I, yeah, I've been kind of trying to stay away from all that. Michael yeah. Jackson thing. I feel no, very you, uncomfortable. You've done a, yeah, I know. He was, he was lovely. I met him on several occasions. Really? He was very shy. I was at a dinner party one night in Hollywood and he wouldn't come in because Sean Connery, Michael Caine and Roger Moore were in the living room and he was too shy to come in and meet them. And he was Michael Jackson. Yeah. So I, but, I was but the Sean hostess. Connery, Michael Caine and Roger Moore. I mean, that's three, that's three, no, two James Bonds and a Michael Caine. And a Michael Caine. <laughs> <laughs> Two James Bonds and Michael Gay. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Which is also... Are we out of time? I'm sorry, we're out of time, aren't we? Oh, I'm sorry, Jackie. Well, it's uh, always we, fun to come here. Yeah, it's all, it is, it is and nice to see you. And you always have such a great audience. They are. You do. They are nice yeah. tonight, actually. Yeah. 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 I, so, listen, if I read this, am I going to be upset? I've do, have you been talking to anyone that no, I... No, you uh... should be very flattered. Oh, really? Yeah, wait till you get to I, the oh, really? by the swimming pool. That is, <laughs> that is so awesome. I've never been in a book, you know. Sly and the Family Stones comes out of Oh, really? Do they? <laughs> oh, so you heard the truth then? Uh-huh. <laughs> That's probably why it's so thick. Yeah. guest is one of the world's uh, top-selling authors. Her latest book is called Poor Little Bitch Girl. <laughs> Ooh, I think I threw my back out there. <laughs> Please welcome the legend and beauty that is Jackie Collins, everybody. Jackie Collins. Hello, 
Hello, Craig. Hello, dear. Hey, I yes. listen, this book cover here, look yes. at this. This is sexy. It's sexy, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Could you this, do that? You know how you do stuff? Could I could you do, do it if you, if you put something tasty on my finger, I would do it. Yeah. <laughs> what did you have in mind? Well, I, I was thinking chicken. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice, chicken, yes. nice piece of chicken. That's how I was doing it. <laughs> you know, I was on uh, on Good Morning America, and they couldn't mention the book. They oh, couldn't say the, the title because yeah, it's called. They couldn't say "Poor Little Bitch Girl" on morning television. <laughs> What's the coming of course? that? That is. You're right. Hello. Hello. Who wrote this no. book? Uh oh. <laughs> Hello. Are there any I'm, bitch? I'm, Am I in this one, by the way? Uh, well, you could be the poor little bitch girl. No, you? no. In the <laughs> last one, you said I was in the last one. You were, you were Don Verona. Yeah. The very sexy talk show host. That's right. Which reminds me. Yes. I was reading in the LA Times that Marie Claire magazine voted you as the talk show host that most women wanted to sleep with. Yes, ladies. Yeah, yeah. yeah no. Oh, yeah. It sounds good, that. Jackie, that, that sounds good, and then you line up all of us guys that do this, and then you go, I see. Yeah, Jay and yeah. Conan, I mean, the ladies are lusting after Jay and Conan, right? Oh, maybe they are, I don't know. I uh, can't talk about any oh, of that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We don't mention we don't the old mention NBC no. oh, okay. debacle here. Okay. Whenever that comes up, I just go, ha, <laughs> ha, That's all. I am a little... Concerned though, because I watch your show. You right? watch this. Show? I watch the show all the time, every uh -huh. night. I TiVo it, right? And I watch it. Why do all the women want to touch your snake? Well, you know, you can have a go at no, it, and then you'll know. I don't want to touch it. I don't want to touch it. Well, but they all go for your snake. Well, the snake is happy. Oh. <laughs> Well, I think, no. it's a, I think it's to do, it's a symbolism for a penis. For them, not for me. I, uh... And also, I read your Twitter about your balls. Oh, I Twitter today, yeah. Yes. I, I Twitter today. Yes. Do you, are you on the Twitter? I am on the Twitter, yes. What's your Twitter I love name? It. I'll, I'll say I'm Jackie J. Collins. Jackie. Why, yes. why the J? Because somebody stole my name. But it's so much fun because you get to talk to people. I know you, you're at midnight, you've had enough of the television, and you think, oh, I'll just go no, on no, Twitter no, for a second. No, 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 1.37, you've had enough of the television. <laughs> Come on, a bit of yeah, help here, Jackie. <laughs> if you're if you're any more negative about this show, I'm going to start calling you CBS. Oh. <laughs> the last movie I did was for CBS. I really? produced a movie, yeah, for CBS. That was about five years ago. What was it called? It was called Hollywood Wives: The New Generation. Oh, that was great. With yes. Farrah Fawcett. Yes, yes it was her oh, last God movie. Bless her, yeah. yeah, I know mm. she was great, Farrah. She mm. was a lovely woman. Were you friendly with her? I was. Did yeah. you know all the Charlie's Angels? I do know them all, yes. Yeah. They were great girls. They were fabulous. That was kind of a, an interesting type. You wrote a lot about that, the, the kind of 70s I and did. 80s in Hollywood, yes, didn't you? Yes, I did. I'm, I'm going to do a photo book, yeah. Were you, were you uh, very uh, active in the social scene? Excuse me? You heard me. <laughs> were you active I in the social scene then? I write erotic sex. Well, I, I, can't, I can't narrow my eyes when I say that with you, because last time I was on, you said every time you say sex, you narrow your eyes. I was yeah. wondering why you were talking to me like yes. that all yes, the time. Yes. <laughs> Do you do, do you do a no, little I bit? No, I want to know about you. I want to know how it felt to be voted the, the guy, the talk show host that everybody wanted to sleep with. Well, it was lovely. Did you <laughs> Did you feel like you know when Brad or, or George are on the cover of People and they're the sexiest man alive? Yes, and they did are. Did you feel like the sexiest talk show alive? Well, I, I refer you back to my original statement. I yes. mean, it's sexy within a, a rain, a guy, a bunch of guys who come on, be fair. You know, we're uh, not. Oh, oh, you know, oh, we're oh. not going to all be on okay. the cover of. It's not okay. Twilight with the talk show hosts. Okay. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Are you watching the Vampire Diaries? That's the no, best. No, I don't. I can't. I can't get serious about any kind of vampire that would keep a diary. That just doesn't make any sense. <laughs> That's just not threatening. Does Dracula like me or like me? It doesn't make any sense to me. <laughs> Do you watch it? Of course. Really? I love it. Do you like it's all fun. this new sexy vampire uh, wave? No, of... only the Vampire Diaries because the guys on it are really hot and they're good. And I love. I love watching those. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you like watching hot, hot guy shows? Do you ever go no, to Vegas like, and see I, the male strippers? I have done so. You have done? Yeah, there's a picture on my website with me and the male strippers. Yeah, because I need to know their story. So I have to talk to them, ladies. <laughs> you understand that, don't you? I have really to say... Really, what, did you have to go out how, and like, feel them out? See what the... Yeah, yeah. Were, you, were, you, were you abused as a child? Is that why you're taking it off and showing your goods? <laughs> I'm actually going to write an autobiography. Shall I tell you the title? Yeah, go on. Yeah, it's uh, Reform School or Hollywood. 
Reform school or Hollywood? Which is, is what that... my parents said to me when I first came to Hollywood, having been thrown out of school like you were. Yeah, well, I 15. wasn't really thrown out. I just kind of drifted away to a bar. Oh. <laughs> so did I. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Yes. And, and then you, uh, you ended up in Hollywood and were very successful. I ended up, you know, elsewhere. Your <laughs> CBS. Oh, I read your book, your autobiography. Oh, Fantastic. yeah, I wrote that. I know. Hi! You, I mean, you wrote it. You wrote it. I loved it. Do you like it? Yes, yes, yes. I, I think that, that you are a very clever writer, but you're also very rude, and I like I'm that. I'm very but rude, He's yeah, rude yeah. in a clever way. You know, sometimes, so. sometimes people think that you are very sexy because you write very sexy, uh, you know, books. Are you a very sexually oh, active Oh, I'm completely straight-laced. Really? Because yeah. I am exactly what I am. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, you believe that. <laughs> oh, no, you're very, you're very kind of sexually adventurous then? Well, are you? Absolutely. But you're not, yeah. you're married. I'm That's single. That's right. I married, can be but sexually still adventurous. You can't because what? you're married, you see. Well. Married men have to be faithful. Uh, the late Louis Moore called me a raunchy moralist. And that's because, <laughs> that's because I write very raunchy books, as you will see in Poor Little Bitch Girl. Oh, well, right, yeah, okay. <laughs> hang on, I'll plug it again. Oh, oh yeah, the, the, right. the, title, the title that couldn't be said. Yeah, no, I like that. The, the... Yeah, I, I think it's a good title, yeah. yeah and no, I, I have a cheating politician in the book. Politicians don't cheat on their wives. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> he promises to, you know what these married guys do? What? They always say to the woman, I'm not sleeping with my wife. And the woman believes them. And then the wife gets pregnant and they look at the wife and they go, oh, well, I had to. It was her birthday. <laughs> You're writing about me again, I see. <laughs> Jackie, it's lovely to see you again. We're completely out of time. Come oh, back soon. It's, it's been too always long. good to be here. Come yes. back soon, then. I'll write another book and I'll be here. Oh, a couple of weeks? Okay. I'll see you then. Right. Jackie Collins, everybody. My, uh, my next guest is one of the world's top-selling authors. Now, an author is like a blogger, but rich. <laughs> well, this one is anyway, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I've decided to do the rest of the show like this. <laughs> what do you think about that, Jeff? I don't care for it at all. all right. Our latest book, Goddess of Vengeance, is in stores now. Please welcome the adorable Jackie Collins, everybody. Congratulations, my dear, on another fabulous giant book full of sexiness and a big picture of your boobies on the back. <laughs> Which do you like best, the book or the picture? Um, I haven't read the book yet. Okay. So I'm you gonna go know. for the boobies, but, okay, okay. but I have to say it yes. is a Lucky Santangelo book. It's a Lucky Then I'll be reading it. She is be back. She is, but Lucky is the, uh, she's kind of like your, if you were Scorsese, Lucky would be your De Niro. Oh yes. He's so right, yes. I am. De Niro, <laughs> yes. Lucky, well, what, what happens right. then in this one? Does, does there sexy things happen to her? Very sexy things. Right, It's right. the worst villain I've ever written, and I kind of channeled him. And when I pick it up and I read it myself, I'm going, oh my God, this guy is so disgusting. He does the most <laughs> disgusting things. And yes, thinking, but Jackie, that comes from that? your mind. So your mind is the disgusting source of his... <laughs> Yes, you're right. No, Craig. inside that, you know. Sort the... of like you on this show. How dare you, madam? Because. Jeff, do you hear this crap? I How have dare noticed. you. What? Hi, Jeff. Hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I have noticed hmm? that not a show goes by. Yes. Unless you mention your man parts. Penis? Yes, penis. <laughs> trying to say. Hey, you know, when you're, you you're, 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 yes. you're writing about uh, penises, because yes, you write, you, you mentioned them once or twice, yeah. yes. you, don't, you don't use the word penis very often. It's a perfectly acceptable medical term for the, for the part of the body. But if you read this book, you'll find that I do. Oh, you actually use the word? Oh, yeah. Do you not oh, say yeah. man parts, then? No, I don't say man parts. <laughs> You're the one that says man parts. No, I, you, remember, you, I remember when you called your equipment Sly and the Family Stone. Yes. <laughs> Anyway, it was Sly and the Family Stones. I was just going yeah. to say that. Stones, yes. No, you have some very good uh, words for... Well, it's just, it's, just, it's just fun. I don't mean anything by it. No, I'm not I trying think it's to... great. Oh, right. I mean, I watch the show every night just you to do? see when you're going to mention it. Oh, yes. I... 
Am I in this book? I was in the last book. You put me in the last book. You were Don Verona. I was Don Verona book. in the last book. He was book. a very sexy talk show host. Yes. <laughs> very sexy. Flirted with all the ladies. Yeah, I did. I flirted with all the ladies. Yes. I don't do that here. Oh, yes, you do. I know. <laughs> I've seen you do it. Well, you know, it's the, you when it. I got the job, though, in yes. all seriousness, I thought, I want to take this job. I was single at the time. I thought, this is awesome. I yeah. Do, yeah, I'll just, I'll, you know, I'll meet everyone in Hollywood, and who knows? And did you? No. Oh. Hmm. I met a lot of dudes. You uh, did? Yeah, yes. Yeah. But you're good yeah. with the dudes, too. I'm all right with dudes. Yeah, you know, you're I'm European, of... you know. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> Does that mean you swing both ways? No, I don't, actually. Oh. No, no. No? <laughs> Well, you might after you read the book. Have you, have you ever, are yes. you ever going to write that, uh, you were going to write an autobiography? I'm in you? the middle of it. Oh, you are going to, yes. you're going to do it? Are yes. you going to actually name names of the secret I'm sexy people in your life? Exactly, yes. Because you've been in Hollywood for a long time. I know, you know I've been here for a long time, but my private life I've always kept very private. Yes. So when I write the autobiography, but I'm just up to, you know, like when I was 13 and getting out of the window every night and going down to Leicester Square and picking up men. <sighs> I had to get my research from somewhere. Holy crap! That's outrageous! <laughs> that's re uh, uh, re at 13? Yes. I was a very adult 13. Yes. That's... And I came to Hollywood when I was 15, when I was thrown out of school. You were thrown out of school. No, you left. Well, you wandered off. it depends on who you, you talk to. You wandered off in yeah. <laughs> What were you expelled for? I wasn't expelled so much as, you know, yeah. kind of like, if you don't come back, that's all right. Oh. I guess mine was kind of the same thing. Really? Although I would wave at the resident flasher and say, cold day today, isn't it? So <laughs> Flashing. Very small. You had a flasher at your yes. school? We didn't even have a swimming pool. <laughs> hey, um... Yes. So you dropped out of high school then? I did, yeah. You didn't go to college? No. And yet you write large, and yet, sexy books? This is my 28th book, and it's going on the New York Times next Sunday. Oh, it is? Yes. Oh, that's very yeah, nice. I'm very happy yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah, that would yeah. be good. And, uh, but I have great fans and great people who follow me on Twitter. You're on Twitter. I am on the Tweety, yes. yes I do. I do, you do a I lot do of tweeting. Of the tweets, yes. yeah. I, like although I think sometimes people can be harsh. Yes. Twitter. I block them. You know you, the block thing? Oh, I love the block oh, thing. You can just block the block them. thing is the best. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It goes on Twitter. Yes. It's kind of like Fabulous. having control over the internet. It I don't is. bother with the internet. Yes. Now. I just I just go on the Twitter and if anyone sees it, me yes. blocked. If they say it even casually, like slightly tiny little bit of You block them immediately? Yep, blocked. Right, like, How many people have you blocked? Oh, I, that's the only thing I don't know. Oh. You know, they, they don't. Well, hundreds, you, like. Oh, no, much more. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've only blocked like four people. And they oh. were all English. And they were all transvestites. What do you think that means? It means that you have to learn to accept your transvestite <laughs> brothers and sisters. Uh, you know, maybe if it's for yes. them, maybe the problem doesn't lie with them, Jackie. Maybe it lies with you. Maybe I you're see. your I have to think about this. Yeah, yeah I have to think about this. Yeah. But it's fun, Twitter. Because you can it talk is. to people and get ideas. You can. And, and meet people on Twitter. Have you ever done that? Yeah, I have. Have you what, met up with them? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? I had lunch with Ross Matthews. Who's that? He's a comedian. I, he's, I, he's great. He's yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ross Matthews, of course. <laughs> I love Ross. He's fantastic. <laughs> does, the, does the audience know who he is, Ross Matthews? Yeah. Yeah? There, there's a lady. That well, knows yeah, the tall is. lady. The tall lady knows everything. She knows everything. Yeah, she's like, oh, that's not the height of Regis Feldman. I know who Ross Matthews is, and I'm tall. And uh, Denise Richards. Denise Richards? Who was married to Charlie Sheen. Oh, yes. How's, you, how's that Twitter? going? Are they still together? No. Oh. <laughs> You've got to keep up on your Hollywood gossip. You know I don't have to, I really. Know. No. What I... I want you to do is write another book, because you're a brilliant writer. Thanks very much. I yes. do like to write the sexy stuff. Do you find when you write sexy stuff that it kind of kind of gets you going? No. Oh, it does me. <laughs> Like, the when you write the stuff, sexy yeah. stuff, it gets me going. No, yeah, well, when you write the sexy stuff, that'll get me going. Oh, no, I do like... Oh. No, but, you know, his books are great because they are incredibly literate, but incredibly filthy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the filthy bit there, because no one would buy it if you just said literate. <laughs> but, that, but when you Filthier tell them it's filthy, the they're like, I need a copy yes. right away! Exactly, exactly. Hey, uh, we're out of time, Jackie, so yes. uh, congratulations on this. Yes. And uh, now, do you want... 
Uh, awkward pause, mouth organ, or go for the big cash Well, prize. I have been thinking about this, and right. as I watch your show all the time, you mm. do not treat your glittery balls very well. <laughs> you kind of, you <laughs> offer them to people. Have you noticed this? He offers his glittery balls, and oh. then he goes, no, you don't want those, and he pushes them back. Your glittery balls need more attention. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> They're not quite matching. Well, that's, that's they... natural. That happens to most people. <laughs> <laughs> so will you keep them to the forefront in future? Well, no, I, Don't I, worry about I, can't, I, can't, I can't come out here and balls you, out you? every night. I can't do that. <laughs> yes, you can. Yeah, yes, yeah. you can. Can't you do the thing where they twirl? Oh, only one of them oh, twirls. Yeah. Oh. Just like in real life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you for giving me your glittery Well, balls. there you are then. Jackie Appreciate Collins, it. everybody. Thank you. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Hey, Jeff, ask me who my next new friend is. Who's your next new friend, Craig? I'll tell you, Jeff. She's a best-selling author. Her latest book, The Power Trip, is on my desk. <laughs> Wait there. <laughs> Her latest book, The Power Trip, is in stores now. Please welcome the lovely Jackie Collins, everybody. Jackie, how lovely to see you. How you look glamorous as always. I loved your earrings and your sparkly jacket. Thank you. I, I wore sparkly for you. I like a bit of sparkle. Because I know you like a bit of sparkle. I do. Do you, do you have a sparkly jock strap? Somebody told me you did. A sparkly jock strap? Yeah. If you write one in for me, I'll have it. <laughs> hey, I haven't yes. got around to this one yet because, as you know, I right. do read your book. I know you do. Uh, but I, I haven't got around to this one yet. You're on it, though. Look. I'm on it. I'm yeah. on it. Yeah. Yeah. Now, does this contain sexiness? Uh, a little bit. Yeah, a lot. And a lot, a lot and a little. Uh, you know what I was thinking? The, what? the Fifty Shades of Grey book that went crazy, right? Yeah. And, like, you've been writing stuff that dirty for years. I know. Uh, I know. Here's the thing. My heroines kick ass. Right. And that's what women should do, shouldn't they? Yeah. You have a lovely audience. This is the new studio. I haven't been in yeah, the no, studio. Yeah, they're, no, they're absolutely marvellous. Some of the best, yes. pe finest Americans <laughs> in the world. <laughs> Um, yes. Okay, no, you're not in this, but there are characters that you could play. Right, I was in the last one, you made me, what yes. was the name of my character? Don Santana. Don Verona. Don Verona, that's yes. right. I was Don Verona, a if you were wondering. A talk yes. show host. Yeah, a sexy talk show host who flirted with all his guests. Yeah. Because I watch you with all these beautiful young women that come yeah. out. You, you have the best time, don't I you? I do, I'm a dirty old man, it's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> they come out and they're like, oh, my film, and I'm like, yes, I yes. I Yes, I tell know. me about your film. Yes, but I have, to, I have to bring that character back. But I was thinking if I make a movie of this that you could play several of the roles. Oh, really? What could I be then? There's a 50-something movie star who never wants to get married with a 22-year-old ex-waitress girlfriend. I love it. Let's yes. do that. Could you do that? He's American. No, oh, well, I could try. He was the sexiest man alive on People magazine. Uh, you're, you're, we're wandering off course now. Never guess who it was. Well, you could play the, the black footballer. You could. Um, I'd say that's a reach, yeah. I think. English. He's English. He's English. Yeah, he may be English, but yes. he is black, and that's going to be a problem. What about <laughs> the corrupt senator? Oh, yes. Now, there yes. you are. That's perfect for me. He'd make a perfect. great corrupt yeah. senator. Is, are yes. there senators that are not corrupt? Is you that kind of like... Play. Hmm? You could play one of the pirates, because there's all these rich people on a yacht, and they get pirated by Somali pirates. You would be a great chief pirate. I don't look that Somalian. I... <laughs> But I can't do the pirate thing. I can do the can hire. No, 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 no. They're modern pirates. Well, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what about the Russian billionaire? Yeah, I'll be the Russian billionaire. The Russian That's billionaire. Right, yeah. You've you got them all in here. There's, there's no room there. for a story. It's, it's just a list of people. I know. I, there's no story. Just a list of people on this fantastic um, yacht. Is that? Did you write it on a yacht? Is that what you did? You know, I was on a yacht. I was on this billionaire's yacht, and we were going from Sardinia to the south of France. As you do. As you do. Yeah. Right? And in the middle of the night, I woke up and I thought, hmm, I'm going to go up and see what's going on. And I went up to talk to the captain and I said, where are we? And he said, well, we're in the middle of clear water, five hours out. 
And I went, okay. And I'm thinking to myself, what if we were pirated? Because it could happen, you know. They're really? Yeah, I don't think closer. they have pirates in the Mediterranean. These oh, yes, they do. They do? Oh, yes. I'm not yes, going. Yes. I'm Robbery. not going. No. <laughs> I suggest that the next billionaire who invites you on a yacht, you say no. Yeah, it doesn't really happen. Larry King asked me to go for breakfast once. You and I, I, I need to talk to you about you and Larry King. I you, love you Larry. You are like an absolute double act. I watched you on Kathy's show, and I was on the floor. It was so funny. I love Larry. Yeah. He's awesome. You know Larry, don't well, of you? Of course. I'm yeah, I know him He's fantastic. You know, he, uh, he used to live in uh, Miami. I found that out last night. Well, I, oh, really? No, I know that all the time. He always says, uh, <laughs> you know, when I started out in Miami, I'm like, you say this every time you're here. I met him in Washington. Very very many years ago, I was on his radio show, right. and it was a very late at night radio show, and he would go to sleep. People would phone in, and they'd ask questions, Larry would be fast asleep, and when it came time for the answer, go, yeah. and he'd like wake up every time. It was like amazing. So he Did called you up- date Larry? No, 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 I am not. I am not Katie Couric. Yeah, yes, yeah, because he, he had that, that supposedly there's a thing that he and Katie Couric had a thing going I on know. in Washington. I know, I heard all about that. Yeah, I think it was one of the rare occasions he was single no, at the time, he, and I he's think that- He's been married many times. Yes. Yeah, he's been married a few times, yeah. like I think 49? 49 times, yeah. yeah. Well, he has a beautiful wife now. Yeah, she's lovely. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. She's the one that's but lasted you, you, longer than the rest. But you're a good double act. It's, it works. Me and Larry? Yes. Yeah, I know. I think Although I like you and Don Rickles, too. You're good together. Oh, do you know Rickles? I know him very well. Oh, I love Rickles. In fact, I'm taking him to dinner this week. Really? I love Make Rickles. sure he pays. He is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, It's no. so funny, because I said, what restaurant do you want to go to? And he goes, it's our night. I went, okay. Oh, really? Right. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yes. Obviously, he's never picked up the bill for you. <laughs> no, I think he does. No, he does. Uh, he's very generous, Don Rickles. It's Regis I'm thinking of. He never picks up the bill. Oh, no, no. no. Never, never. No, never. It's a, he's pathological with him. He's like, oh, I gotta go. And boom, out the restaurant. <laughs> Or it's always the time they go to the men's room, right? Right, right. They go oh, to the, the it used to be, you know, uh, back in the old days, men would go to the restroom for cocaine. Exactly. Now they just... Now, have you ever taken Viagra? No, no, never needed it. No. Never needed it. No, no I, I think I probably did need it back when I was drinking, but, you know, when I stopped drinking, that problem kind of went away. Yeah, so, but, yeah. but, 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 but you wouldn't need it then because you wouldn't know. No, no, I, I never, I've never had the... Uh, had the I, thank goodness, you know. But what, knock what, on what, what do you think about... <laughs> about these ads that you see when guys take Viagra and, and they go, well, if you're still hard after four hours, go to the doc. I mean, what would you do? I'd go to a club. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect answer. Yeah. Perfect answer. Yeah. No, I, I, don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I think it's like it's helped a lot of people. It's fine. It's a kind of a cool thing. I mean, have you, is there a lady Viagra? I don't know, but I think there is. There's bound to be I something. Mean, if, you, if, you know. you, if you can't do it without props, then why do it? Well, it's not necessarily a prop. It's just kind of like a vitamin for your junk. Oh. <laughs> He's taken it. He's definitely taken it. I have not taken it, I swear to God. No, I tell you, I would tell you if I'd taken it. I'm not in any way sexually embarrassed by stuff like that. Look, I talked about, you know, peeing and pooing myself when I was drinking. I'm not going to be worried about it. You know, one of, the, one of my favorite things that you said when I was on the show last time was when you talked about your junk, you called them uh, sly and the family stones. <laughs> Don't you love that? Great description. Yeah, sly well, and the family know. stones. Whenever I hear them, I always think of you. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's lovely to see you again. The Power Trip, thank you, Collins. We were right back. is a best-selling author. Her latest books, Confessions of a Wild Child and the Lucky Santangelo Cookbook, are... <laughs> a cookbook, Jackie! They're in stores now. I'll talk to her about it. Jackie Collins, everybody. Jackie Collins. You are lovely. Greg Ferguson. It's lovely to see you. I didn't it's know you'd written a you cookbook. Too. I did. I wrote it specially for you. Did I thought you, really you, you did look not. like you needed a little fattening up because you're getting too handsome. 
Ooh. Oh, I think somebody is a little bit too Hollywood this evening. Oh. Hey, um, oh, what, yes. what, what, what is it based on what uh, it's Lucky based said? It's on my character, eats. yeah, and, and I thought it would be fun to do illustrations of Lucky, little scenes between her and Lenny, and these fabulous recipes and great drinks. There's a, a drink there called the Jackie Collins. Created by Wolfgang Puck. Really? Is it yeah. got alcohol in it? Uh, it has, but you could have a virgin. You've had a virgin, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> I've never had a virgin, Jackie Collins. <laughs> yeah, I think that would be a bit difficult. <laughs> a bit I don't know, no. A yeah. man can dream. Um, <laughs> Hey, uh, do you know, yes. remember you put me in that book. You said I was uh, based on a character that in your... Don Verona. Right. Yes. Well, well let me just... Uh, well, I'm just... Um, this is a surprise. OK, I'm going to describe Don Verona to you. Don Verona was movie star handsome with jet black hair, dark eyes, rugged feature, and a trademark two-day stubble. He was an extremely... This is me at all! <laughs> It's him, isn't it, ladies? No. Yeah. He was an extremely successful late night talk show Definitely host. not me. He, he was Letterman without the Midwest hang ups. He was Leno without the insults. And he was Craig Ferguson without the Scottish accent. Oh! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's uh -huh. the clue. Yeah. Yes. All right. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. That's funny. Okay. But I, you know, I, I never knew. Yes. There was a mo an old movie of mine on cable the other day, and I stopped as I was going by. Right. And there was a scene in it. I wrote the movie. Yes. And you are mentioned in it, and I forgot to tell you this. Oh, that's There's charming. a guy in a, a guy in a book. He's reading yes. a book, and yeah. uh, and uh, someone says to him, "What are you reading?" And he says, "Kafka." And he says, "Oh, I'm reading a Jackie Collins at the moment." <laughs> and then and then he says, "It's a sh you know, a Jackie Collins would be better. You know, you wouldn't get a giant bug in a Jackie Collins book." And then he describes, uh, you know, the Kafka story metamorphosis, yes. but in the style of Jackie Collins. You know, his wiggly woggly arms held her tight and all that kind but of stuff. But you would get a you would get a giant something. If you it was you would get a giant something in a Jackie Collins book for sure. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. well, you got to have fun. You do like a, a, a racy bit of dialogue and uh, and and scene said. You do write some very good sex scenes. I have to say. Oh, thank you. You know, I've been doing it a long time. Time. So have I, but I can't write it. <laughs> you can talk. Your book was so filthy. Very filthy, and yeah. And so literary. It was a great combination, literary and filth. Well, my theory is that women like to read their porn, whereas men like to see it. So if you can... <laughs> Like, men like to look at pictures and go, oh, but women like to think about it and go... No, no, no. Women like to see it, too. I mean, Do they? Do you want, well, that's disappointing. Do you want gigolos? <laughs> <laughs> Do you watch Gigolos on television? I've seen bits of it on my yeah. friend Joel's show. He shows clips of it, but I've never I know, watched that. It's hilarious. Yeah, it's yeah. It's funny. I think women like to kind of laugh at porn. Because when you see graphic porn, it's always very angry. And you're thinking, well, nobody's having a good time, so what's the point of this? Right. Um, okay, well, we can agree to differ. But the... <laughs> But the, but Do what, you watch a lot? I don't watch a lot of porn, actually. I kind of, I think sex to me is a little bit like, uh, is yes. like um, billiards. Uh, it's very, very boring to watch, but it's very fun to play. And you, you know, to, uh, and you try to get the ball in the pocket. And always try to get the ball in the pocket. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good for you. Yeah. Craig. You know, it's just. Yes. It's. It's a technique that I learned in Europe, and I feel that the ladies uh, appreciate uh, it. Uh, 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 huh. No, I, I do think it's erotica. Uh, it's, it's not really, you don't write erotica, you just write erotic scenes in stories. I though. write relationships. I right, write you do, all yeah. All kind of people, you know, all colours, all sexual orientation, all ages. So there's something for everybody, and that's what I think it is. I mean, we live a life where we see everybody every day. I mean, you know, you walk out, and I, I try not to write closed books. I try to write books that are about everybody and they're fun and they're sexy and people can have a good time with them. Yeah, you're, you're a renowned beach author, aren't you? Like, people read your yeah. stuff in the beach. I think what happens is, you know, you have a couple of alcoholic beverages, lie in the sun <laughs> too hot, uh, toast yourself a bit, give yourself uh, liver damage and, uh, <laughs> and, and get, a bit, um, yes. get a bit randy. Oh, a bit randy, yeah. love. Bit bit randy. Randy. Do you Ooh. think Randy is a better word than horny? I love Randy. Randy's yes. good. Randy's like, ooh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm so Randy. Ooh, I'm Randy. <laughs> and yes. horny sounds like, ooh. Yes. You're right. Yeah. You're absolutely right. Yeah. You know, I was in London recently and I met the Queen. Is she Randy? I think she's Randy. Well, if she read my book, she would be. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I feel guilty even discussing the possibility of Her Majesty the Queen <laughs> being Randy. <laughs> She said to me, oh, Miss Collins, because I got the OBE. Oh, congratulations. Order I had no idea. Thank, thank you. Lovely. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. That's wonderful. I know.
So there I was in Buckingham Palace, and she says wow. to me, um, oh, Miss Collins, um, I understand you've written many books. And I go, yeah, not bad for a school dropout, huh? And she kind of laughed, and then she proffered her hand, and, and you have to back off. All right, you when she goes like to, that, and you yes. have to go, like a dance-off? Yes. No, you're, you're not allowed to turn your back on her, so you have right. to kind of back off, hoping that you're not going to trip up and break your neck. Really? You're not allowed yeah. to turn your back on the Queen? What, will no. she knife you? No, I guess so. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Maybe if she'd read one of my books, she would. You know, when I was young, I was very anti-royal. I was when I was in, I was into punk rock, and I was all, I all hated all, all of that. I want to see a picture of you when you were a punk rocker. Well, I've got one somewhere, but I mean that's not the point. What I was saying is that that I was very, okay. and and what I have found as I get older is I yeah. rather like them. Yeah, they're rather interesting. Yeah, and also yeah. when you know you look at all the politicians and you think, well, I wouldn't like you to be on the currency. You're a bastard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But, uh, what do you think of young Harry and all his goings on? Oh, he's just a young. He's a yeah. he's a marine. He's been in combat. You know, yeah. he's uh, he's you know if he, if he wants to blow off a little steam, for God's sakes, let him. I mean, I I got no problem with that. Yeah. I mean, it's not like he was. You know, I know actually uh, a couple of guys who have been over there with him. And and he does the job. You've got a secret smile. You know more than you I'm think. I'm impressed by that young man. He, yes. He doesn't. It's not a publicity thing. He does his thing. So if he yeah. wants to go and get naked and drunk in Vegas and some time off, that's what he's yeah. fighting for the right to do. Why not? Yeah. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Right. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. Now. <laughs> Are you trying to, for years, soldiers have been taking a break when they get back yeah. home. Nothing wrong with that. I have a lot of soldiers who write to me. They, oh, they, really? I yeah. bet you do. <laughs> so, yeah. I have a lot of people in Russia who write to me and prisons. I'm very big in prisons. <laughs> well, I guess me too, got... for different reasons, I think. <laughs> Why do you visit prison? No, not <laughs> Have anymore. You been in prison? Since I stopped drinking the Jackie oh. Collins. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, yeah. why are you so big? I guess because they, they like a story. They and... like a story, and you know they've got nothing else to do. Well, so. there is that the whole prison idea, isn't you it? You never know. It's what a big they're long do. time out. Yes, yeah. but they all write to me and complain. They go, you know, I went to get your book from the prison library, and they're all they don't have them. Everybody's borrowing them all the time, and then they come back in bad condition. <laughs> but, I don't know what that means. Although maybe I do, yes. Well, I know. Uh, a lot of things come back in bad so that's condition. Why I didn't, you know. Uh, <laughs> anyway, we're out. We're out of time. We're out of time. Yeah, yeah. You're yeah. not going to analyze me with your pipe. You have a big pipe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, big pipe. Yes. It's not a pipe. You're welcome, students of Magritte. <laughs> There's about five people in America who went. Oh. Ah. <laughs> So, uh, yes. okay, are you in analysis? No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm English, we don't do that. Do you do that? Oh, yes. Oh, you do? Oh, yes. So what would Once be a, week. a normal, how would you start off the conversation? Oh, you wouldn't believe the week I've had. No, yep. well, I, how I start it off is, <laughs> it's a great day for America. Uh, <laughs> a great day for yeah. America, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You gotta go, Jackie. Okay, baby. Jackie Collins, everyone. <laughs> I'm reading Jackie Collins' book to Jeff. We're on chapter four, Dateline Los Angeles. Ooh. All right, ready? Yeah. Being the girlfriend of a huge movie star did not sit well with Laurie Walsh's ego. Oh, yes, in one respect, it was all strawberries and cream. <laughs> her name was out there. People were nice to her, important people. All the magazines featured photos of her frolicking on the beach in Malibu, just like you. <laughs> I can't read out this bit. There's a penis in it. Uh, who would you be in a Jackie Collins book? Would you be the pirate or the skeleton with a creepy past? I'd be the pirate. <laughs> I'm looking for these books are real pot boilers, you know. Pop, and by pot boilers, I mean, uh, you know, testicle stimulators. A testicle stimulator, yeah. Yeah, that's what pot boilers means in French. Uh, is that kind of like a freshie? <laughs> Do you think that's a slang word for a gentleman's excited uh, moment? <laughs> I know what it's called after he's excited. What? A sullen monkey. <laughs> On that upbeat and classy note, we bid you adieu. Adieu!